Troy Hines County has been trying to terminate the current consent decree, but now it's been scaled back. There are still some issues that the jail needs to address. That Hines County Sheriff Tyree Jones says that this is a step in the right direction. A final ruling on the trial for the detention center have not been determined yet, and the jail will now operate by a scaled back version of the current consent decree released by District Judge Carlton Reeves. Sheriff Jones says the detention center has already been addressing some of these issues since the trial ended. So I look forward to continuing to do that. Again, I look forward to continuing to be dedicated to the cause of detention services and be able to collectively work with everybody that's involved regarding the issues that we're plagued with in detention services today. The current detention center in Raymond has a shortage of officers and a history of incidents, including the death of six inmates last year. Sheriff Jones says one of the pods called the A-Pod is not safe and currently houses a little over 100 detainees. Blueprints for a new Hines County detention center were released last month and plans to address issues with staffing and dangerous inmate conditions. Hines County is motivating detention officers by increasing the pay and also having back-to-back -back classes in hopes to hire more people. Live in Raymond, Grayson Gordon, 16 WAPT News.